Here are the results of our GMA flash poll. We asked you, do you think there's a formula for online dating success? Overwhelming, 82% of you said no. Okay, well, let's huh? talk about it now. Dr. Michelle Callahan, she's a psychologist, author of Ms. Type, Ms. Type, mm -hmm. Stop Sabotaging Your Relationships and Find Dating Success. There's the book right there, Dr. Callahan. What do you make of this? <laughs> I think it's exciting. It shows how much people are still really looking for love, and he was willing to go the extra mile to find the one for him. And so many people are going online. We, we often talk about the success stories of people finding, finding love. Any suggestions on the best way to go about it? I think you should be really honest in your profile. I mean, you see he was trying very desperately to match up with other people. So you want to say what you really believe. Represent yourself well. Let your personality come out in your profile so people can really get matched up with the right folks. I think you should also use more than one site because each site obviously measures the compatibility in different ways. So you're going to get more hits for compatible partners if you're looking at more than one place. Aren't you going to embellish it a little bit? A I know. <laughs> I'm Self, perhaps. Uh, and it, it, he had 88 dates, so it, it didn't work. But for 87 dates, you know, he was 0 for 87 until that last one. So it seems also don't let a horror story stop you here. Absolutely don't let a horror story. And I don't suggest that people binge date like he did. That was He did a lot of dates in a very, very short period of time, like two dates a day. It would be exhausting. But, yeah, you should definitely feel encouraged. Sometimes it just takes some time. And I think people should use other forms of social networking to get other connections, friends of friends. So it's not just letting the algorithm spit it out for you in the computer, but letting people who already know you, you can get to see their profiles. You learn a lot about people before you ever even go on your first date. Yeah, I think that's the thing is that you can use the algorithm, so to speak, to, to get to the dating part. But once you get out in the real world, it's really up to you, right? I mean, so is there really a magic formula? It's, there's no magic formula. It's really be yourself, open up, enjoy the dating part, not be rushing to the end. That's a big problem that people rush to the end so fast. Enjoy it. Yeah. Enjoy the journey. Not a destination. It's true. Exactly. Okay, thank you very much for sharing that and your thoughts with us. Now to Olympic skiing star Lindsay Vaughn opening up about her insecurities off the slopes. Speaking to Self Magazine, 